Google Docs is a word processing app that is similar to Microsoft Word and is part of Google Workspace. It's easy to use and has many useful features that can help you to make a resume, write a letter, make a list, or create another kind of text document. What's the best thing about Google Docs? It's absolutely free to use and can be accessed anywhere, including on your phone, tablet, or computer. To get to Google Docs, first you need to navigate to www.google.com and sign into your Google account by clicking the Sign In button on the top right. Enter your name and password, and then you'll be directed back to the Google homepage. Click on the cluster of nine dots in the upper right-hand corner, scroll down the pop-up menu until you see Docs, and then click on the icon to be directed to the Google Docs app. This is the Google Docs homepage where you will find your documents once you have created them. To make a new document, hover over the plus icon in the bottom right of the screen. Click on the top button to create a new document from a template, or click on the bottom button to create a new blank document from scratch. Templates can be especially helpful if you are wanting to make something very structured, like a resume. Google has tons of templates with different designs to help you make your report, legal letter, brochure, or other document look its best. We are going to be showing you how to create and navigate a document made from scratch. After clicking on the Create New Document button on the Docs homepage, you will be taken to a blank document. To create your document, simply click on the blank page and start typing. To rename the document, click on the title in the upper left corner, type the new name, and hit the Enter button on your keyboard. Google Docs has lots of formatting options that can help you get your document looking its best. Hovering over the icons on the toolbar will tell you what each tool does. For example, if you want to make text bold, you can highlight the text you want to bold and click the Bold button in the toolbar. What if you're starting a new sentence? Well, you could just click the Bold button before you begin typing, and when you type, the text will come out bolded. What if you want to insert a picture into a document? Google Docs makes that easy. Simply click on the Insert Image icon in the toolbar, select where you want to upload the image from, select your image, and follow the prompt to put your image into the document. To move the image or change the size, drag the image to the correct location on the page using your mouse or trackpad and resize it by dragging the corners of the image toward or away from itself. Need to write a report that requires you to change line spacing, add columns, or add page numbers? This can be done by using the Format drop-down menu or by clicking the appropriate icons on the toolbar. You can even add in graphics such as tables to do things like make a sign-up sheet by using the Insert drop-down menu. After you're finished creating your document, you may need to run a spell check or make sure that you have met your word count. To do this, click Tools at the top of the page and select what you would like to do. Once you've run any necessary checks, you can now print, email, or download your finished document. What if you want to share your new creation so that others can view it or make changes? This can be easily done by clicking the Share button in the top right and following the prompts. As always, practice makes perfect and the more you use Google Docs, the more skilled with it you will become. Thank you for joining us on your pathway to knowledge. Happy computing!